Good morning, Greater Lake Trobe. From the WCAT TV studio, I'm Paige Lesko alongside Kethry Heasley, and these are your morning announcements. The spring bike trip is going to Pittsburgh this year on May 9th. Anyone interested in signing up should see one of the phys ed teachers for more information. Attention students who have taken art classes this year, please bring all of your A work for the 2016-2017 art show by Friday, April 21st. You can drop your work off in F201 or F205. We will, hang, we, will, we will hang the show on Monday, April 24th in the CSC. Any senior who has taken several art classes in the past four years may hang a senior window. The library has a collection of books that are no longer needed. These items are on a cart located immediately inside the library entrance. Please help yourself to any of these items. You may keep them without checking them out from the library. Items will be added over the coming weeks, so check back periodically for anything that interests you. All members of, of the Ushers Club, please stop in C101 and see Mrs. Butler on or before Tuesday, April 18th. Rogers and McFeely Memorial Pool is hiring lifeguards for this summer. If you are interested, you must go to La Trobe Parks and Recreation in town to pick up an application. Since this is an interviewed position, you as a future adult should pick up and fill out the application yourself, not your parents. If you are a current certified lifeguard or will soon be and looking for employment, this is the perfect first job. Please call the Latrobe Parks and Recreation Office at 724-537-4331 if you have any questions. Do you want to work for GLSD this summer? Hours are Monday through Friday, 7 to 7.30 p.m., and the pay is $8.50 per hour. Work includes general cleaning, moving furniture, and some groundskeeping. If interested, please send a resume to the 1112th grade office by today. Employment opportunities for the Rolling Rock Club in Ligonier are posted in the 1112 office student waiting area, along with a variety of other job opportunities in the area. Please stop by for weekly, for, for weekly new postings. There is also a full-time summer internship opportunity through Unity Township Municipal Authority. Please stop by the 1112 office student waiting area to find out more information. Camp College registration is open. Camp College is an intensive three-day, three two-night workshop designed for rising high for rising high school seniors and juniors, paired with mentors, participants will learn about all aspects of the college search and application process. Experience life in the residence halls, learn about financial aid, standardized test exams, and have fun. At the end of Camp College, students should be equipped with the tools to navigate the college admission process. Sixty students will be accepted to the camp at Allegheny College in Meadville, PA. Online applications are due May 1st and can be located at www eacac.org. California University is having a free event titled A Trip Through Time on April 29th from 11 to 4. The event will feature living history opportunities in the form of reenactors, hands-on demonstrations, and displays. There will also be a poster contest with prizes awarded in the form of scholarship. Any student who applies to Cal U at this event will have the fee waived. For more information, please visit the events page on Facebook. Congress Congressman Murphy is hosting the United States Service Academy Information Day at 8.30 a.m. on Saturday, April 29, 2017 at Upper St. Clair High School. Stop in the 1112 office for more information. There is a new paid summer youth philanthropy internship opportunity for current juniors and seniors. As an intern, you will have the opportunity to learn about the greatest needs in your community. Discover how nonprofit organizations work. Build your professional resume while earning a great salary in a business setting, and meet teens from other, from other counties making a difference while you are making a positive impact in your community. If interested in more details, please see Ms. Hager in the 1112th office. The application deadline is April 31st. All wrestlers and football players are reminded that there is a strength and conditioning Tuesdays and Thursdays immediately after school until 5. If you are playing a spring sport or do not have practice until later, you can still attend the lifting sessions and leave early. Also, Freestyle Club for Wrestlers has started and it is Wednesday and Thursday from 5 to 6.30. You would just need your USA card to participate. Any wrestler and football player who plans to participate in the season next school year should begin their off-season now to see the success next year. Please see Coach Schmeling if you have any questions. Get ready to light up La Trobe on Saturday, April 29th with the annual Glow Run. The Glow Run is a two-mile walk run held at Greater Lake Trobe Athletic Complex beginning at 8 p.m. Receive a Glow, Glow Run neon t-shirt if you register before April 7th. At the finish line, runners will join an epic glow dance party with all of your Wildcat friends. Get your squad together and, and check out 
www.dlsdglowrun.weebly.com to sign up. Now here is Zach Kokoska with the weather report. Thanks Paige. Today we are looking at a high of 64 and a low of 39 with partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow expect overcast with a high of 65 and a low of 46. And Friday we will have a high of 70 and a low of 55 with partly cloudy skies. That's all for weather. Back to you. Love the environment? Want to make Latrobe a more beautiful place? Then participate in the annual Trash Pickup Day on Saturday, April 22nd from 9 to 12. Bring family and friends to help clean up our town. Stop in S110 to see Mrs. Logan for details. April is Alcohol Awareness Month. Did you know that approximately 7,000 children in the U.S. under the age of 16 take their first drink every day, which is a major problem because those who begin drinking before the age of 15 are four times more likely to develop alcoholism than those who begin at age 21. The Sad Club reminds you to make safe and smart decisions. Now here is Nick Melizia with the Sports Report. Congratulations to Letterman's Club Athlete of the Week, Senior Ashley Pigelli. Ashley threw a no-hitter shutout against Indiana area. Ashley had nine strikeouts in the five innings she pitched in the game, which ended up early due to the mercy rule. The Lady Cats won the game 12-0. Congratulations, Ashley. For WCAT-TV, this has been Catherine Heasley and Paige Slusko. Thanks for watching and have a great day.